Three, that's right. Two, one, <laughs> go! Please, Whoa, see you later. All right. <laughs> oh <laughs> my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> Isaac, your balloon's gone, buddy. Dude, oh, get popped. And we, we, we made it. Woo! Hey everyone, my name is Grape Applesauce, and welcome back to another episode of Boundless Modded Survival. I hope you're all having a great day today, as we are here to have another productive episode here in Boundless. We are going to be doing the first group event we have ever done on the server. Around seven of us are going to hop on the server and participate in a balloon race today. I also have some other things to do around the area, so stay tuned for all that, but we of course wanted to start with prepping for the balloon race we'll take a look at the clipboard basically we're going to be doing actual blow up balloons like at a party and we're going to race around tibsy's area and i'm really looking forward to that as well as doing more group events with people on the server that's something that's really important to these smps is having a community and doing group events so if you have any suggestions for that let me know in the comments section i love to check out all of your suggestions and just reply to a bunch of my comments so let's get prepped up for this balloon race later in the episode i do want to work on something called a cobble works which is really cool but let's just get the balloons out of the way first so what wait what is that there's just some sort of laser is this straub's prank back on me i thought the timer was already enough but here he is doing yet another prank are you kidding me what what is this this time it's a laser and some stone what oh, wait i can't mine this i can mine these blocks i can't mine this block Straub, no. He did not just do this to me. Let's see what this laser is, I guess. There's only one way to find out. We can't mine it, so... No, he did not put alarms in my house every time I walk into this storage room. Why would you put alarms there? This is like my most frequently used area. He definitely watched my episodes and knew that for sure. Every time I walk in here from now on, it's just going to be annoying alarms. No, is there any way I could stop this? Oh, no. Yep, there it is again. Reinforced stone all the way around. There's probably no way in. Yeah, reinforced stone down here as well. So he really did a good prank back on me. I wasn't expecting something that elaborate. I'm not going to lie. So props to you, Straub, on that prank. You definitely have just declared a prank war on me. I enjoy prank wars, and I already have an idea on how I'm going to get him back. Stay tuned in a couple episodes from now. I will be doing that. But I have to contact him if I want this removed. He is the one who owns these blocks. With security craft, you can go ahead and reinforce blocks to make it so that no one else can mine the block that you reinforce unless it's, of course, your account. So the only way for me to remove the alarms is to get Straub to come on and delete it himself or if I could somehow hack his account but let's be honest here I'm not going to hack his account or am I so yeah, this is just a minor annoyance that we're gonna have to get used to for a little bit here. I think there is maybe one thing that can get rid of this. It's called a code breaker. I think it allows you to break reinforced blocks, but it requires another star. And that is something I do not have at the moment. But if we go into my storage system here, I do have wither skulls. So I am going to be fighting a wither. Before I fight the wither though, we do want to make some balloons real quick since we are just sitting right here. These are the ones we're talking about here these deflated balloons so we need a purple dye rubber and string i already have plenty of that wait why does rubber not go there i have a ton of it right here well there we go we'll just make it like that there we go 16 balloons these balloons you can blow up and there you go you hear my character blowing them up and there you go you place them down on the ground now if you place leads to these things let's go ahead and get some leads out if you attach them to the balloons like so it actually makes you float around and if you go high enough well you can leave the atmosphere so i gotta be careful with these balloons here we want to crouch and pull myself back down to the ground these things are pretty cool though we're gonna be racing with them later so yeah, let's get back to the wither thing. I'll meet you in a mine where I'm gonna go fight this thing. All right, so we are here in my cave. I think this might be a good place to spawn in this wither. So I guess without further ado, here goes a whole lot of nothing. I have all these pets on my hotbar here, ready to help me out. I got strength and speed. And here goes nothing, ladies and gents. Here we go, fighting a wither, splashing down the potion. And here we go. Bring it, buddy. 
You're gonna give me that code breaker I need. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, I got strength. You ain't doing nothing to me. Boom, I'm gonna kill you with ease. Oh my gosh. You are dead. You are done for already. Get absolutely wrecked. Oh my gosh, these pets made it so OP with the strength boost. There it is, the nether star. Thank you so much. And there we go, we got ourselves a code breaker. Now I was actually doing research while making this thing and I don't think the code breaker has anything to do with any of these reinforced blocks. So if I click this, I don't think anything will nope. happen. Yeah, so it just used some durability, although nothing happened. I still can't break the block. We'll save this code breaker because that'll come in handy. I can actually break down down, like password protected doors and chests with this universal owner changer I believe we can go ahead and make these blocks from his name to my name if this all works right so it's pretty easy to actually make this so let's go over to the crafting grid and craft it up right now since we already have the stuff and there we go universal owner changer I don't think this will work yeah we need to give this item the name of the new block owner this is not your block you cannot change it oh it didn't work well now that we are pretty much screwed at this point when it comes to fixing that prank we might as well go on to the next thing today and that is to work on the cobble works a little bit that I showed off in the last episode we had a magma crucible up there but we want to generate infinite cobble stone sand glass Pretty much all that sort of stuff today. So to do that, we are gonna need some extra machines. So let me pull out this other clipboard. These are some of the machines we will need. We already have the magma crucible. We're gonna need another pulverizer and another redstone furnace. So let's craft those up. There we go, we got a redstone furnace. And there we are, we have ourselves a pulverizer. So these are the two machines here that we are going to place with our other stuff. So to not trigger that alarm, let's just escape using these nice little teleporting anchors right there. There. All right, so this is what we got last episode. We got a magma crucible that makes a bunch of lava. Now we want a system that imports cobblestone and goes down a line of production. So we'll have something to pulverize and then we'll have something to smelt. We want a pulverizer and then we want a redstone furnace. Basically, we'll import the cobblestone. Some of it will get pulverized into sand or gravel and it will get smelted down into like glass or something. So let's go ahead and get this all figured out and I will be right back. Well, I think I'm ready to get this thing going. I'll explain it as I go, but we might as well just start importing everything right now. So we have some cobble going here, that's fine. We wanna spread the cobble out to everything. So basically this pulverizer is going to put the cobble in it it's gonna spread it through the magma crucible as well, but it's gonna make sand and from the sand, the sand's gonna get exported, put into this furnace, smelts out, and it'll put it back in this chest here. But it seems like that is not working. So let's just do this maybe. If we make this furnace accept like that, and there we go. So now we actually got this thing working here. It needs to extract the gravel out though. We're having a problem with that. And it's gonna to need to extract the glass as well. So we're having problems with extracting these items, but basically it's already in working order. We got this igneous extruder as well, making tons of stone. It's gonna infinitely make stone because with stone, it only uses the water source and the sink from cooking for blockheads provides infinite water. So we got an infinite supply of stone going in to this right here. All right, so we have this working now. Now we have the glass getting extracted from this furnace. It's being put into this ender chest here, which links up to my main storage system. So we have the cobble going in, it gets pulverized. I wanna make sure the gravel's getting sent back as well. We got sand pumping out. And it looks like we got gravel in this chest as well. So it looks like we got this entire system working. It's creating infinite lava as well. Let's also hook this up. I don't know why I haven't done that. And there we go. We're constantly extracting stone. So now if we go back to my base, we can see our stone, cobble, and glass, and sand supply slowly digging up. So, and there you can see the stone counting up. So there we go, we got all that stuff, as well as we want the glass to have its own drawer. We'll put the glass right here. Gosh, this is just great. I love this system a whole lot. Very efficient, I think I'm proud of it. All right, guys, welcome to our uh, very first event on Boundless. You guys excited? Because I'm really excited. Yeah, oh, you know what? I might oh. even jump through. Oh. And Where'd you go? Where is he? <laughs> Where, where'd he go? He's in his house. He's up there in his house. Hey, hey Tibbsy. Hey, <laughs> what up, dude? Oh, hey, what's up, man? Oh, wait, hey, dude, really? what are we doing today? Open up your chest, take a look at what's inside if you already haven't done so already. Uh, 
Uh, yeah. Oh my! Oh, wow! I like what this could it be? It could be a weird balloons. Event. Yeah, some balloons. balloons. We're gonna be doing a balloon race today, ladies and gentlemen. And okay. uh, you know, uh, it's pretty self-explanatory. We're gonna go from this point oh. over here. Once they're all inflated, and go all the way down. I can't see on my render because I only have. I can't see it. There it is. Let's inflate our balloons. Let's get them all side up in this. Okay. Yeah, so how does this go down? So what do we do? We do we blow. Blow them up with your with your mouth. Right click, now hold it. Hold uh huh, it, uh huh. I got him. I got him. It. There we go. Then you're gonna place fast. Place, place them place down. Fast. Oh, wow. Put leads oh, on them. Oh, no, it <laughs> my Where'd it go? I'm flying up. Wait, great. Wait, wait. See you later. Let's yeah. do this. <laughs> All right, three, two, one, go. Go. Oh, I'm, oh, off. I'm off to a good start here. All right, wait, not so bad. Did you send it flying? <laughs> Maybe. This is Maybe. good. This is good. This is good. Nice and steady. Nice. Careful. Same. And oh, dude, I'm actually, I'm, I'm so high up. I don't even know where I am. Oh, I think, somebody's oh balloon God, broke. I'm just tapping. I'm just tapping. Can I swim to the end? <laughs> I'm gonna make it. Isaac, I can't believe you, dude. It don't work. He did it legit. I didn't do it That was good, though. That was, we made it. Some of us made it. So did I. Alright, three, two, one. No! Please! See you later. Wait, I, I just figured out B's secret. She does it backwards. What? Yeah. No, what? She started it backwards. I, I saw her. She started it right on the first. I'm already getting bungeed. It's over. Mass, Bye. Play smart. Play smart. All right, here we go. Here we go. Smart, dude, step up the skills, Voss. It's pretty no, honestly. I'm just... it. No, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. No, Am I in first? Yeah. Right, B. I'm winning! You got to go too high. You got to wait for Grapes in first, I'm no! Oh, wait, these in front of me now, too. Great. Tipsy, I'm flinging what, around. What if, I, what if I fling myself to the finish oh line? Does that count? Oh, oh, Tipsy, I'm coming. I'm gonna fling I'm myself gonna to the finish line. I'm it's raining. How did you pass me? No! I won! No, beat it now. My balloons aren't working, guys. Congrats, right, well, I Congrats. Congrats I on the win. second again. I guess I'll just take third. I what do you mean what you happened were to you? Me? Uh, I was in the lead and I made a grave error, oh. my friend. Because yeah, <laughs> he's, he's already a lead. <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> Three, oh, down, dude. two, one, go. Okay. Uh, go, 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 go. Let us know when right. we. Let us know when we can use bows, by the way. Oh yeah. yeah can okay. I shoot you guys two. right now? One. Oh. Okay, now you can use them, so don't kill me. All right, Tipsy. Sorry, don't kill. your balloon's gone, oh. but oh. Right, I popped my own. Run, I I'm just running. I'm just shooting down. I'm just trying I'm to. Shooting I'm shooting down. Down. No, Dude, down. I have one balloon. No. It's all right. I'm just running. I'm not even coming down. I'm just going to run. I'm falling okay, down. Pop, pop no, I'm here. Wait, what? Um, one. Isaac, your balloon's gone, buddy. Dude, I just oh, get popped. You got one now. Straub, how's it going over there? With that one okay, balloon. Okay, guys, so oh. uh, this time had a great success, great start, but um, I got a little bit cocky and I started to use my bow, and two oh, out no. of my three arrows popped two of my balloons. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah dude, same. I, I shot my own arrow on too. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna count down. So this one's for all the mobs. Make sure you use your arrows wisely, and uh, you know, I'm gonna get a head start. Good luck. Okay, right, three, two, one, go. Oh, I'm going. Hey, I'm going. hey, there we go. hey, 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 there's oh. no good luck. All right. <laughs> oh <laughs> my you goodness. Won. You can use your bow now. You can use your bow. Might All be a little bit of All right. I think I'm good on that. I shot my own. Oh my god. I shot my own can someone get uh, shoot shot one of my teams? We're neck and neck, I shot dude. My own twice. Oh. Oh. The hope is real in this one, boys. Boys. Oh. Oh. Shoot my balloons. Thanks for the uh, the lead. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Going down. Wait, what? Isaac, what? What is that? Pop his balloon. No. Pop his balloon. No, he's a cheater. I didn't do anything. Oh, I, didn't oh, I hit fast. Oh. <laughs> Wait, you hit me in the head, dude. <laughs> I, need, I need to pop another balloon to get through. Oh, I made it. And oh, we, guys, we, we made it. Woo. I passed the finish line so long ago. Where are you? <laughs> it just took me a long time to get down. Mm. Oh, hey. I don't even know. I don't know. Well, guys, no, I didn't know. I shot two of my arrows. To the video. Oh. I think this is a great ending to the video. I've got an arrow in my head. I believe we're all winners here. Am I right? Yeah. He's right. All right, now we are back from the balloon race. That was a lot of fun. I definitely want to do more group clips in the future. Next on the list is a storage upgrade and to clean up my chests. I have all these random chests over here full of junk. 
And I want to finally move them to my storage system today, even if I will never use these items. I just want to get these out of here, and of course it starts raining. I still have no sunflowers to feed this person. So yeah, we're gonna have to deal with it for a second. So what I went ahead and did was added another 4K storage disk to the system right here. So we can go ahead and drop a lot more items in. Here's some stuff from that chest, and we're just gonna flick a bunch of this stuff in that I don't really need, and I probably will never need, but it's okay to have it in the system now that we have enough storage space. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna clean up a lot of those chests over there, and I'll be back in a moment. We are just about organized at this point. If we run in here, we'll check how many items we got in the system, but if you just shut up alarms, if you just look in this right here, as you can see, I got a bunch of random items, especially ones with just one item, and that's okay, because we have enough space to house all of these items. So as you can see, we nearly maxed out our second drive, so we're at 3,000 to 4,000 items. And then we haven't even touched this one yet, so we're about 58% full right now without the, the fluid one, of course. So I'm very glad that this has worked out. I finally have cleaned up all the chests around my area. There's this one here, which has all the, the chiseled and all those other blocks. There's just so many variants of the same block. I'm not wasting space on that. And then this one over here has a bunch of like junk food and stuff in it and just more junk. So these are the junk chests that I'll have. I'm gonna move them somewhere in specific, but it's so nice to have all these chests finally empty. Well, let's check off these final two things because we are now completed with episode 12. I really hope you did all enjoy this episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like. It really does help me out. Leave me some suggestions for more group events we could do on the Boundless server. I'm looking forward to conversating with you in the comments section. And other than that, I have course wanted to remind you all to stay positive keep a smile on your face and just know that i appreciate each and every one of you thank you so much for watching goodbye